All right, guys, we're back. I don't know if this is gonna be the final episode. It's shaping up to be a little bit longer request. I don't know. <laughs> or I'm just slow doing it. Whatever. I'm gonna try to finish it pretty soon because I got another follower mod I want to do, which is the Lucian follower mod. And I already uploaded a video. Well, I just recorded it. <sighs> well, who cares? We're, we can deal with it. We're awesome. But anyway, like I was saying, I'm just gonna you know finish this up, and we'll try to you know. Start Lucian whenever we can. But yeah, I just wanted to tell you guys that. Where this, I know this little mini series, quest mod series is going. It's been pretty long. I mean, when I recorded the first two videos, I was like, well, I'm gonna make these long because they're probably gonna, it's probably gonna be a short mod. But I was like, okay. And now I'm just like, what am I doing with my life? No, I'm just kidding. It's pretty cool of a mod. I'm going to need to do a fall on mod soon. <laughs> I recorded a lot of Skyrim mods lately. Over here. Quest, my mo quest mods. Let's try to do that. Bouncer! You're going down! Aha! Now I'm taking your bot off. I just like taking people's bodies with me. <laughs> every vlog, every game by Bethesda, you get the. I like picking up bodies. Prey, Fallout, Skyrim. And the Elder Scrolls games. I think most of them do. Not enough in the other, other Bethesda, Bethesda games you can specifically pick up bodies the whole time. <laughs> How are you doing this? It's fun. Someone do something! Hi, what's your name? You picked a bad time to get lost, right? I'm not lost. You have no name. Cause my girl wants to party all the time, party all the time, while they're having fun. What was that? Over here. Gambling. Cause I, my girl wants to party all the time. Doggo, the doggo helped me. He's like, thank you for saving me. They forced me to do this. They, they made me kill my brother. That was fun. Just for their enjoyment. Oh, but you killed the doggo. Wolfo. Wolfie. Hey, what's up, you guys? I'm just gonna take this page. Is that alright with you? Alright. Blah blah blah. Something about. Um. Tacos or something. I don't know anymore. Mira, calm down. They're in the cage. Sorry. My girlfriend's freaking out. Yes. I guess this is it, huh? Well. We've come this far. She has become one with the ice. What? Oh, I'm sorry, Is Mira. that it? <laughs> A bit anticlimactic, don't you think? Oh, she died. How am I supposed to find her? <laughs> oh, you can sense her presence and... I don't know. Somewhere else. Your vampire bud. Blood makes you do. How do I know she's way out here? I guess I'm magic. Oh, great. Enemies nearby. Would you guys leave me alone? 
I gotta go find my girl Mira. It's it's lover's uh, intuition, knowing where she is. Our love knows no boundaries. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. My horse can walk on ice. For some reason, this ice is moving the water. Does someone just make a mod that just specifically makes this ice move? A bob up and down. I need that. I, I guess it's slightly frozen right here, but it, I don't know. It doesn't look really frozen. Oh, maybe this is. No, this is not land. That is kind of icy. Mira. I'm searching for you. How do I know she went this way? Seriously. I think this is like all ocean, isn't it? Isn't there like a like a, a place distant from Tamriel that's we don't even know much about. I wonder if they're ever gonna do something in the game. Like, I, I want to go to one of those regions and start out in one of them, please. I don't know what the region of the next Elder Scrolls game is gonna be. Remember that little teaser they released? Oh yeah, it's gonna be out in five years. Don't worry. We're, we're actually making it. Don't worry. I'm gonna be like 40 years old when, the, when seven comes out. But if it comes out in 2020, in eight years, wow. I don't even know if it'll come out that early. <laughs> One can hope. Looks like we've been playing Skyrim Special Edition for like the rest of our lives. I'll be in college when I finally play that game. I'll be able to afford it. I Never should have come here. Never should have come I don't even know where we're at. That the best did her, like, her dad teleport her here? Just the you guys are pretty strong. Why are there so many? Uh, time to use my magical powers. <laughs> oh yeah, I got a suit up. Iron Man suit. Oh yeah, I got my friend. See you later. So dragonborn, do you have any idea? Wait, I, I I gotta talk to. I don't know what's happening. Your soul. Everything's freaking out. Wait, Just as well. Yeah, Why is there? What is happening? You're dead. There's too many. Oh, this guy. Gotta get revenge. There's a big mess here. Yeah, I was gonna take forever. I didn't do that. Sorry, guys. I'm gonna kill the rest, please. Why is why is he so strong? I thought I killed him too. 
Killed you too. Did you guys just not die? Maybe I need to kill him legitly? I don't know. Laying on the ground now. Yeah. Maybe I can kill him if I just uh just go like crazy with this. Yeah. Off the platform, please. Can't stand fighting you. You won't die. Why are you essential? Where's Mira? I want you to die. So you have to kill him legitly, I guess. The key. Finally kill him. Hey, what's up, man? Your turn to die. I have 5,000 health. What are you going to do about that? Just tearing away his mouth open, taking it. I think I screwed him up by using cheat spells. Hopefully he'll die this time. I might do something for you guys. This is Wait! Problem. Don't kill him! I need to talk to him! Yeah. Get me out of these chains! Oh, I forgot your. Hurry up, I'm, I'm gonna kill him. What's up? What's up, Mother? Why are you doing this, Dad? What is so important that you've forsaken your family? Uh, family? You mean my ungrateful stepdaughter and that meddlesome witch of a wife? You both had the chance to be a part of something Tamriel will never see again. But you insist on rejecting it. Tell me, why should I put you two before anything? This is how you really think, isn't it? Nearly 18 years of my life, and I've never been anything more than disposable. That's all you are. Pay for that. A shell for that wretched heart of yours. <clears throat> is my blood really worth more to you than my life? Not just your blood, but your soul yeah. too. <sighs> Your very existence is extraordinary, and those assets mustn't be squandered. Mirak must return. Your life is insignificant compared to his. As his servant, I must return you to him. All this time, that's all I've ever been to you. You can't be saved. All that matters to you is that stupid job. And for what? What do you get out of it? Why is it worth my life? I don't care who I am or what you want. I'm not going to let you trade my life for his. Why must you be so selfish? Why do you have to hurt us like this? Why do you? <laughs> Shout? I 
I don't know. My heart just started beating so fast, and all the heat that's been building up inside of me. I just couldn't take it. Is this it? Is this all you wanted from me? This is worth no one's life. He still has my mom. He loaded her onto the boat already. You have to get her before they sail off. Who knows what those beasts are going to do to her? Oh, uh, are you coming with me? I hope so. We're gonna steal the boat, we're gonna keep it, then we're gonna sail off to distant lands. And I don't know what else we're gonna do. Go away, whatever you are. One of these things when I first played Surge Plane Skyrim, it's so annoying. It's annoying me a lot. I don't know, they're just pretty annoying. You know what I'm saying? Alright, guys. Ooh. Okay, I guess it just goes out to sea or something? I don't know anymore. My blood is burning. Nice. Feels so good. This bear's just fighting over there. Don't care. No, the bear and a walrus. What are they called? Let's go rescue. No one's guarding the boat. Nice. The Luna. Ooh, cool, cool name. Who's here? Anybody? What was that? Use your smart. Of course I'll. Oh. <laughs> oh. Wow, that, that ended pretty easily. There's someone in here. What? Take a saw. Nope. Downstairs. Okay then. She had announced she was lying. She said she'd wait for me. No. Wait. I think I just sat down. Now wait, this is the plot. That's what I'd been like. Uh, just go ahead and uh, kill me. It's actually a key. to save you. Oh, I forgot you look good too. Oh, that was the key to get her back. That was on uh, that guy. Yeah. No, no, I'm fine. You have to go after Mirai. Zenon has her. I said he's, he's dead. Dead? Oh. I, he wouldn't quit until the very end, huh? This agenda of yours really worth your life, Zenon. I just wanted him to come back home with Mirai and, and me and forget this ever happened. Well, I guess that was a bit naive, wasn't it? He went to such great lengths, but I have no idea why. The first... What? Then... Zenon was right. She is special. Maybe I was quick to think the worst, but that still doesn't excuse what he did. If that's the case, Mirai should be protected, not exploited. Ah, uh, What happened to the man I knew?
Zanen and I met when we were very young. I was about Mirai's age. We fell in love instantly. He was much different then. We were really happy once. A couple of years after we met, I realized I couldn't have children of my own. Zanen was devastated more so than even me. I think that was the point he really started to change. He became so religious then. It was then when he joined some religious group. It turned him into the man you saw today. Mirai entered our lives shortly after. I realize now that the cult probably murdered Mirai's birth parents. I don't know how I could have been so blind all this time. Uh, Mirai will still need protection. There are a lot more like Xanon, and once they find out he's dead, they will send someone else. It's not safe in High Rock for Mirai and me. If Mirai lets me, I think I'll live with her. That way I can help her and you as well if you need it. Anyways, we should go speak with Mirai. She must be feeling very confused right now. Uh, okay, let's go speak with her. Okay. We need a gas ending of the game. 300 cookies for beating the game. Quest. Oh, she didn't come down there to help her. I don't actually hurt. Found your mother. She's in harm. Thank you. Thank you so much for everything. My dad, he's really dead, isn't he? He is, but I'm still here, Mirai. I know how hard this must be for you, but he was also my husband. We've both lost a lot. I know, Mom. I'm sorry. I... Can we just go home now? Mirai, it's not safe. It's still not over. Your father... Zenen, he's not the only one they'll recruit. They won't give up on the descendant of the first Dragonborn so easily. We can't go back home. You told her? Why would he want to keep it a secret from me in the first place, Mirai? It's better this way. I can look after you easier. You've already done so much for me. I don't want to worry you anymore. I know a lot of things have changed, but I'm still your mother, and all you have left, it, it's pretty much my job to worry. So, where do we go now? Let's just stay in your home in Markarth for now. I don't think many people aside from your father knew about it. It should be safe. If we need to, I have a couple of friends here in Skyrim that could help us. Okay. Besides, we might be safer knowing the Dragonborn is looking out for us. I know she was probably a pain in the butt at times, but thank you so much for saving my daughter and for guiding her through all of this. It's not much, but if we can help you in any way, don't hesitate to let us know. We'll be in Mirai's home in Markarth if you ever need us. Come on, Mirai. We should get going. Just give me a minute. I need to say a few things. Okay. So, not much to say that my mom already hasn't, but I just wanted to say it again. Thank you. What will you do now? Hide, I guess. I know I haven't heard the end of it. As long as the cult stands, they won't stop sending more people after me. Maybe some day down the line, I'll find a way to put a stop to them. But until then, at least I can always count on your help, right? It's not like you got anything better to do. And in return, if you ever need help with anything, I can come along. I might as well put these new powers to use, right? I may not have as many powers as you, but I'm sure I'll grow stronger the more time we spend together. We can be shop buddies. What do you say? Shout buddies? No, let me stop you there. I'm leaving. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. It'll, shout up <laughs> It'll be so much fun. I look forward to it. Anyways, I should head home for now. If you need anything, you know where to find me. And now I can probably make her a follower now. And that's how you do life. 
Congratulations, everyone. We are now the Dragonborn Buddies. We're Shout Buddies! That's why I named the episode Shout Buddies. We gotta do that. Perfect name of the episode. Yeah, I got a name of that. Shout Buddies. Perfect. Perfect title. Yeah, I'll say that. Shout Buddies. Uh, where was their house again? Is it right? It was one of these. Oh. I wonder what this place is normally without the mod. Maybe it doesn't even exist. The door maybe doesn't even exist. Probably does. I'm not sure. Or it's just some random person's house. That doesn't matter. What is it? What is your settings? About what you wear. Some arlets. Oh, okay. Chef. Sure. Nightingale. What's your chef outfit? Yeah, okay. Oh, there you go. Keep your hands off Don't of even me. wear anything. What? <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Yeah? Follow me, I need your help. Of course. It's boring when you're not around. Well, guys, that's pretty much the mod if you want to download. That's pretty much a cool little quest mod and to get her as a follower. So there you guys go.